Hi everyone, welcome back to the Planner 5D channel. I'm Virginia, and today we're gonna walk through five different ways you can create a room using all of our different platforms. But before we get started, go ahead and subscribe to the channel and please give this video a like. So we're gonna start with how to draw a room. This one is really easy to do. This is a great option if you have a room that isn't quite a perfect rectangular square and it just allows you to be as custom as you need. You can always go back at any point to move your corners or you can add new ones to create an extension of the room. So let's say you have a wall that you need to just be a little bit more thick. All you have to do is come down here to the thickness tab and then make your adjustments. And the same could also be said for the internal dimensions. You also have the freedom to make the room height whatever you would like it to be. So if you want 30 foot ceilings, go for it. And finally, adjusting the thickness will affect each wall instead of just one. Next up, we have the scanner room feature. This is probably the one I'm most excited about because it's just so cool. So start by opening up a new project and selecting the scanner room button. Then from there, all you have to do is move your phone up and down to capture all of the corners and make sure you go up to the ceiling. This will just give you the most accurate measurements. And I really love that as you start to scan, you can start seeing the model form. It's really cool. <laughs> make sure everything looks good in your scan and then you can customize it any way you'd like. So the Smart Wizard is one of my favorite tools when I have to get something done kind of fast. You can quickly select a room shape, adjust its dimensions, and even get a ready-made design. All of this in a matter of like three minutes. What's really great is there are a bunch of different design styles to choose from, and you can even shuffle through different presets until you find one that works for you. And you can also use it as many times as you would like. So, you know, here we have our living room set up, and now we're gonna quickly add a kitchen as well. All right, next up we have the upload a plan feature. Say you've got your floor plan ready to go. Now you can just upload it directly into Planner 5D and get a 3D replica within minutes. After you upload your floor plan, make sure to crop your image and add measurements in as a reference for the size of the space. This is really great if you just wanna jump right into design mode without having to design the entire blueprint by hand. And finally, we have the old reliable add a room. It's really as simple as it sounds. Just select one of the room shapes listed and then customize the space any way you would like. All right, that's it. I hope you found this video helpful and let us know in the comments which video you would like to see next. Thank you so much for watching and happy designing.